hi guys so today in this video we are going to learn how to use an infrared remote with an arduino so for testing purpose we have used an led and we are switching it on and off with an infrared remote so without any further delays let's get started So these are the things required for uh, our this project. An Arduino Uno, an infrared receiver. I am using TSOP1738. Now let's connect the receiver with the Arduino. First, connect the ground of the receiver to the ground of the Arduino. Then connect the output pin of the receiver to the eleventh digital pin of the Arduino. Then finally connect the VCC of the sensor to the 5 volt pin of the Arduino. There are many models of uh, infrared receivers uh, like TSOP1738, TSOP1838. The pinout of the each model may be different so be careful when giving the connections. To download the library go to my blog and go to the tutorial page of IR remote with Arduino the link will be provided in the description then under the section software and library is needed click the download button for IR library for Arduino then you will be taken to the github page of the Arduino IR li remote library then download the zip file Then go to Arduino, then go to sketches, from there include library, add dot zip library, click the choose button. Now from file menu go to examples and search for the library we just installed, IR remote, then choose the program. IR receive demo. Now go to the 29th line and change the value x to decimal. Then upload the code. Open the serial monitor and press some buttons on the remote. And some decimal values will be printed on the serial monitor when we press some buttons. Now let's connect an LED to the circuit. Connect the ground of the LED to the ground of the Arduino. And then connect the anode of the LED via a 20 ohm resistor to the digital pin 9 of the Arduino. Now declare two variables called code on and code off for saving the values of two buttons of the IR remote. Now declare another variable called code for saving the live values from the sensor. Now assign a name for the pin at which we connected the LED. In the LED is the 9. Now set the pin mode for the LED pin as output. Write digital write LED comma low inside void setup to make the initial state of the LED low. Now inside this if block write code is equal to result dot value dot dec now we can write a new if block to check whether the newly received value is equal to the one which we have saved for code on and code off and if the value is correct for code on, we can write digital write LED comma high to make the LED on. And for code off, we can write digital write LED comma low to make the LED off. Now click the upload button. 